Good morning, everyone. I'm making a poncho and thought I'd share it with you how I'm doing it. You start off with 94 chains. It's for a child and it's four ply yarn. I'm using a J hook. It did call for an H, but I was having a hard time making the the circle, you know, um, a, what do you call it? Oh boy, crocheter and can't even think. Um, connecting it, there's another name for it, but okay. And I'm using Pioneer Woman's um, yarn, which is my first time. It's very thick, it's very nice. And uh, I will post down below where I got the pattern. And also, if you're on MeWe, I will, you will be able, if I post the, the link to my page there, you'll be able to see this when it's completed. I like making these, and it's just, like I said, a double crochet and a chain, and you move on. Three of these. But I like making these in, around Easter time. I think they're cute for little girls or older girls, I guess. Maybe even a woman. I don't know. Um, and, uh, and for the spring. So now that I come to where you connect, I wanted to show you that in the corner. And that'll be it for now. Um, I chained one. And now I'm going to go to the top of the chain three slip them and now slip stitch the next two double crochets now we're in the space and that's really what you're working in the spaces so you're going to slip stitch chain three and then do two more double crochets a chain one and move on um yeah, if you have any questions, you can post them and I'll get back to you. This is three and a chain. It's a very thick yarn for a four ply. I hope you can see what I'm doing. I just get busy going to town here and I forget to look up to see if you can see it. Um... I'm not crazy about these colors, but I guess they're supposed to blend nice, so we'll see. Okay, another three. We're getting closer to one of the corners. And one more. Three, chain one. Now we're going to do a first corner. Yep, go into the chain one space, do three double crochets, a chain one, and three more right in that space. One more, and a chain, and then you're going to go on to the next one. And that's about it, really, and... um. Like I said, I'll post where I got it, and uh, and that's it. And I hope you enjoyed this little tutorial, or whatever you want to call it, sharing my poncho I'm making. And when you're done, you're going to make a chain. It tells you how long, and you weave them in these holes until you come together. And then, so they can tighten it and make it, you know, tighter. And uh, put pom-poms on the bottom. So I will post the picture on my MeWe when I'm uh, completed. But you have a good day. I hope you kind of enjoyed it. And I hope you'll share it and come back. You have a good day. God bless.